Hi there, kids! It's time to read Chapter 9 of The Little Mermaid. At the end of Chapter 8, the evil sea witch had just appeared, totally uninvited, obviously. <laughs> Let's see what happens next. The sea witch had just crashed the party, and, um, it was awkward. So, um, anyone know any good jokes? I know one. How did the sea urchin cross the road? Uh, how? It didn't. I don't get it. It's an inside joke. Time's almost up, by the way. Uh-oh. I had to get the prince to declare his love for me, and fast. If that didn't happen soon, then I'd be a sea urchin forever. What's the matter, dear? Cheer up. It's a party. Right, Prince Jeff? Wait a second. Your voice. You sound so familiar. Darling, don't you remember me? I rescued you. But you're not a mermaid. No, sweetie, I'm not, but... You fell in love with me, remember? I remember now. And you said we were to be married, remember that? That's right. Excellent. Let's all just forget about all that silly nonsense about mermaids and sea witches, okay? Okay. Great! All right, who's ready for a royal wedding? Cool. Sounds great. Mazel tov. Oh no! Everyone was hypnotized by the evil sea witch's spell. Well, everyone except for me, Dolph, and my dad. I guess the spell only worked on real humans. I don't even know how evil magic works! Okay, quick rundown on why this is very, very bad. If Prince Jeff marries her, then the mermaid turns into a voiceless sea urchin. And we turn into jellyfish, I think. All these curses and spells are starting to get confusing. Then the sea witch will take over the entire sea kingdom. And she'll be royalty here on land if she marries the prince. She could take over the whole world. We gotta stop this. Yeah. And now the part where we come up with a plan. Operation Defeat the Evil Sea Witch, part one. He may have had human legs, but my dad was still the almighty sea king. And that meant he could summon an army of the toughest sea creatures to help us. <gasps> Is this thing on? <gasps> uh, what's up, your majesty? I need you to gather all your friends. It's time to battle. While the Sea King explained the situation to the shark, Dolph began his part of the plan. Which brings us to Operation Defeat the Evil Sea Witch Part 2. E -e 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 hey guys, Dolph, is that you? What happened to your tail? Uh, that's not important, but listen up. I need your help. Dolph explained everything to his dolphin brethren while I went to work on my part of the plan, stall for time. The sea witch had put everyone to work while she was just lounging around in a deck chair, sipping on a pineapple drink and barking orders. I don't want crab, I want lobster. You call these flowers, try again. More shiny thingies, more ruffly stuff, more everything. Jeez, what a bridezilla. We're almost finished with this dress. Oh no, we have to start all over. Oops. Wedding today, 3 p.m. <laughs> now to find Prince Jeff. I'm so excited to marry my true love. Poor guy, he doesn't know what he's saying. Hey, let me out. I have to get married to my lovely bride. Ugh. Okay, I hope Dolph and my dad are ready. What do you think you're doing, you urchin? Oh my goodness, we better go find out what happens next in chapter 10. Click here to come with me. Come on!